Hello Aquarius, how are you today? Yeah, this is Tawana recording again, you guys. You can watch this for your sun, moon, rising, or Venus. I've been on YouTube since 2007. This is probably my third channel. I just keep coming back. <laughs> now, a lot of you dealt with air signs, and I also see water signs here, too. I see a lot of y'all getting into business stuff, signing paperwork, taking care of some things as far as transactions, employment. Some of y'all might be getting a job. Also see fire sign coming your way. Also see a lot of you thinking about marriage with somebody as well. You know, just being stable, living together, having fun. But I also see some sneakiness here. I wouldn't advise you guys to uh, deal with anybody in your own element right now because that would not be good. Because I don't really feel like y'all going to be really compatible with your own sign or any other earth sign. I mean, not earth sign, but air sign. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> or maybe you are dealing with earth sign energy too, but I don't really, look, you know, pick it up right now. I mean, if y'all are dealing with Earth, y'all probably about to get married to that person or y'all, you know, doing some business with them. The way I see it. Fire signs are very important. You might be getting messages for, from somebody that got fire in their chart for sure. Um, Definitely seeing money in this week. Also see heartbreak this week. Some of y'all might be heartbroken from somebody and you just feeling like this person don't care about you no more. Somebody's definitely hurting your feelings. Um, earth signs. Now, I do see earth signs coming y'all way. For some of you, it could be your mom or it could be, you know, somebody you're dealing with. But the way I see Aquarius right now, you have too many options to settle down for one person right now. You might be highly confused and you don't know whether you want to deal with them. And the reason why is because there might be a fire sign, somebody with fire in their chart, and you don't know whether you should be with that person or be with somebody else. Now, earth signs and fire signs, they seem like they're going to like you a lot around this time. Um, but to clarify a little bit more, I feel like you, all you might be thinking about right now is work, Aquarius, trying to get your money up. Definitely. What else can I say about Aquarius? I want to put everybody in one video, but I might not be able to. Um, Aquarius, watch out for conflict and stuff with fire signs as well. I see a lot of that coming up as well. Uh... Just seeing a lot of heartbreak over shit. Somebody is sad as hell that something did not work out. Somebody is, you know, seeing more than one person. Definitely. And I also see a lot of you are getting your work shit together. Like I said, you might be working two jobs. You might not have no time for everybody right now. But the fire sign is not going anywhere. I can tell you that. And you're not going to open up and let anybody know what you're doing either. But watch out for the drama with family and friends, neighbors. You know, any of that shit, you know, you might be getting pissed off. A lot of y'all might be thinking bad thoughts like you want to hurt somebody. So try to stay away from that, you guys. Now, let me move on to Libra. I haven't did no readings in a long time online. For those of you that's trying to get in contact with me, you can always just, you know, text my phone. I would rather y'all text my phone to ask for a reading. 330-519-7923. That's a... The best way you can get in contact with me, for sure, by texting me. And I accept PayPal and um, Cash App, for those of you that don't know. But a lot of you might come back and, and you know my channel, pretty much. And also, everything, you know, is down in that description box as well. If you're looking for candles, sage, or anything like that, you can go on my website. Now, Libra. Libra, I see a new start for you. A lot of new starts. Some of y'all just got into a relationship. Some of y'all just traveled, moved, or, you know, I see a relocation or something for some of y'all. Y'all might be thinking about moving. But it could be a new job. Could be a, meeting a new friend. Definitely seeing new money and seeing another air sign around some of y'all as well. Uh... I see good news definitely coming in for those of you that's waiting on money or something or you just looking for a promotion or something like that. Whatever you're waiting on is coming up probably next in the next two days, it looks like. Especially if it has something to do with work, communication, or travel. But there's going to be a lot of thoughts on the past, definitely, especially about water signs. You're going to be thinking about how a water sign was very nice to you or when you 
sign some paperwork definitely and that could be any type of paperwork let me see Libra Libra try not to distress too much that's one thing I can say. No stressing because whoever got you stressing could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. And I know a lot of Aquarius be dealing with Libras and Aquarius with Geminis and Aquarius, Aquarius. I know it's a lot of shit like that going on. But it seems like your past energy has a lot to do with people with water in their chart, though. Um, As far as money, money is coming. Like I said, I see a lot of pinnacles here. You know, seven of pinnacles, always some good news connected to that you know, your money is definitely growing around this time but there's conflict around your situation and you're trying to stay you know nice and stuff <laughs> for those of you that are not staying nice i feel like it's because you're waiting on shit to pop off in your life that's why you're not nice and you might just want to stay to yourself or you might be thinking about the past that's why you're not nice but good news is coming to libra for sure Libra. All right. Well, I'm going to move on. Like I said, I haven't recorded in a long time. Move on to Gemini. Hello, Gemini. What's up with you? I might do a bonus on Libra because I don't feel like I did that good enough. But I'm going to... Um, Definitely look into Gemini right now for sure. All right, Gemini. The way I see you, money was definitely coming to end. I see a good job for some of you in the past. Definitely see good news this week. But I feel like you don't want to spend money on nothing. Or somebody around you doesn't want to spend money on something. But you got a job. If you don't have a job, it's coming. Definitely. I see you talking about it like very soon. And I also see you telling somebody that you don't love them no more or they telling you that and you like fuck you you might just leave the situation behind a lot of drama going on a lot of indecisiveness going on uh earth sign might try to come back your way if they do it might have something connected to money okay and y'all might communicate about you know how you feel somebody loves somebody more than the other person does i see unrequited love connected to you in the earth sign and I definitely see you doing things your own way now. Like, you're not trying to, you know, really backtrack on some stuff. But you're still open to communication, it seems like, Gemini. For sure. What else is going on with Gemini? The way I see Gemini right now, you had a lot of past situations going on with water connections. You had a lot of money go through your fingers, definitely. But I see a lot of drama this weekend for a lot of you you might be getting phone calls from fire signs or something or you might be just feeling like some of y'all feel like y'all in love with somebody y'all don't want to let these water signs go you know you might be like i don't want to let you go maybe we've been together too long but you might be bored with them so i see you in your head a lot because of money and i also see you you know cutting shit off because you're just tired of being in your head about something maybe you just want to live stress-free and you definitely don't want to tell people all your business. It's all about having a new start for you, too. You ready to start something brand new. This is definitely a new year for a lot of you. And you, you're just getting started. It seems like you haven't even jumped your year off yet. Gemini. But, um... I feel like whatever is coming up, I feel like you got to end the cycle in your life right now because it's causing too much stress. And you want to go back to being nice again, especially if you got water in your chart. You might start being nice again for sure. And people might start seeing that the kind hearted person you truly are. But try not to, you know, overdo yourself. You know, I know a lot of y'all are hard workers. Y'all want to get the shit done. And that's how I see you during the next couple of weeks. But damn, Gemini. What's really going on? Because somebody left you hanging. I definitely feel like somebody left you hanging. Could be an ex-cousin, ex-wife, or ex-boyfriend, girlfriend, whatever. But they was not there for you when you needed them. I hear somebody saying, you don't 